Hello, my name is uh, Burton M. Louis Jr. Uh, I'm an associate professor of anthropology and African American and Africana studies at the University of Kentucky. And um, I'm a cultural anthropologist who studies uh, Haiti and the Haitian diaspora of the Bahamas. I'm the author of a book called My Soul is in Haiti, Protestantism in the Haitian Diaspora of the Bahamas, where I study issues of um, religious conversion to Protestant forms of Christianity and uh, understanding uh, the Haitian Diaspora transnationally uh, as well. Uh, I'm also interested in issues of statelessness, uh, human rights, anti-Haitianism, uh, and race and racism. And to answer the question why uh, anthropology. Uh, anthropolo anthropology was kind of a way for me to understand more about my own heritage growing up as a uh, first as like you know as a young black person uh, in like Staten Island, New York. I was subjected to a lot of uh, you know racist bullying, and, um, and at, at the point in my life, I really internalized those ideas of you know anti-blackness and. When I went off to Syracuse University as a uh, undergrad, I took a Intro to Cultural Anthropology course. And the Intro to Cultural Anthropology course uh, had a very provocative statement on it within it when we were discussing race, and they talked about race being a social construction. And for some reason, I had you know internalized the idea that it was rooted in biology, and it was a very you know profound moment. And then moving on. Um, you know, doing well in that uh, Intro to Cultural Anthropology course. Uh, you know, I ended up getting an A in that course, and I decided to declare an anthropology major. And then the next semester, I'd, um, uh, I added a, I took a, um, a course with uh, Horace Campbell, who's a Jamaican political scientist, brilliant mind, uh, called Caribbean Society Since Independence. And the first book we read in there was The Black Jacobins by C.L.R. James. And that uh, book had a deep, deep impact on me. In Haitian Creole, we have a phrase saying, we flap him for, which means it really hit me really hard. To know that like this is part of my heritage and uh, to be part of this you know, successful slave revolt and you know, resistance to white supremacy and dehumanization was you know, very inspiring. So I married my um, interest in cultural anthropology, specifically its methods of participant observation to help me kind of build uh, a Haitian identity and, um, and just learn more about the world and learn more about uh, people of African descent in the African diaspora.